My aim in this video to show how multiple AI agents can work together to solve tasks automatically in ServiceNow. Stay tuned till the end. Let's get started. If I type AI agent in the filter navigator, then I can see AI agent studio here where I can see overview, create and manage testing settings and analytics. In the overview, I can just see some information here and below that I can see agentic workflows and AI agents. And uh, in the create and manage, we have option here and here both uh, in that we can create the AI agents and even a agentic workflows. In the testing, we can test the AI agents. We can just select uh, what AI agent we want to test and then uh, we can test that here or, or we can test the agentic workflow as we will see that in some time. In settings, we have different options to remove offensiveness and settings related to memory and manage LLMs. In the manage LLMs, we have two uh, LLM providers that is Azure Open AI and now LLM and in analytics, we have AI agent analytics dashboard. Okay, now let's go to create and manage and create an agentic workflow that plans the travel based on the weather condition. Okay, so before creating the agentic workflow, I'll create the AI agents. I'll create two AI agents, one AI agent to search the weather and a second AI agent to uh, suggest whether travel is suitable or not suitable based on the weather condition. Okay, so I'll just go to new. Now here we need to uh, give the name, description, uh, role and instruction to the AI agent, but uh, we can use now assist as well. So here I'll just tell this AI agent will get the weather details based on city name. Okay, so I'll just type in this prompt and I'll click on generate. That will generate the name, description, role, name, description, role and instruction it just provides that okay then we'll click on save and continue okay now it's time to add the tools here now uh, it will show us the recommended tools as well or else we can just add the tools from here so these are all different types of tools now for this action uh, i need to connect to external api so for that i'll just use flow action okay so i'll just you search whether uh, and in the description I'll just copy that search weather based on city okay now i need to attach the flow action here so i'll just do search weather so i have this already created so i'll attach that okay so if i go to uh, the workflow studio then we can see the search weather flow action here where we'll just take the city as the input and in the rest step we are just calling a open uh, weather map API and then uh, from there we are getting the output and we are just returning the output back okay so I'll just go back and in this city is the input okay and uh, here we have execution mode supervised it means uh, whenever uh, it tries to perform this action it asks permission from the user so we don't want to be supervised uh, we want that to be autonomous okay and display output so it means uh, so let's keep this yes and later we'll keep this as no okay so let's add that so now we have added the tool to the uh, ai agent now let's click save and continue okay now if there are any triggers for example if uh, that uh, let's go to add trigger and now trigger can be created updated uh, or uh, created or updated okay so or it, it can be uh, a schedule based okay or it can be inbound ml okay so but in our case uh, we don't want uh, the trigger so we'll leave it as is and we'll go to define availability and this status is yes okay now we'll click on save and test okay so now uh, so uh, in the testing also we'll get the same interface so where ai agent now the ai agent is selected weather info agent i'll just type in here weather in Mumbai okay so I'll just do that and start the testing so once I start the testing uh, now the AI agent will understand the city as Mumbai okay so yeah here uh, you can see uh, it identifies the city as Mumbai and then start searching for the weather for that and here it has returned the weather for Mumbai okay now uh, we can see the name city is Mumbai and here we have temperature that is 27.99 and we have the humidity that is 83 okay so this is how we can test okay so this is our first ai agent now let's go and create the next ai agent okay. uh, so i'll just click on new again i'll use now assist 
take weather conditions and based on temperature and humidity humidity find out if it's suitable to travel to that city or not okay so i'll just generate this okay now we have travel suitability agent and description is filled role is filled and instructions are also filled so i'll just click on save and continue okay and now we need to add the tools here so i'll just add i have one more flow action now uh, that flow action is travel plan based on a weather so in this i have added just a script step here uh, that just takes uh, checks whether temperature is less than 18 and humidity is greater than 60 any one of this is matching then that is not a best condition to travel uh, if other than that then it is a best condition so it is simple uh, condition here okay so i'll just take the name from here okay we can give any name here okay and uh, we need to search for the flow action so i'll just attach this flow action okay now in in this uh, we have weather object as input okay now this also we don't want supervised so we'll just keep it autonomous and we'll just add it okay now let's save and continue okay let's save this okay uh, now we'll not test it here we'll add it to the agentic workflow and we'll test the agentic workflow there okay now let's create the agentic workflow so we'll create new Now here also we need to provide the name description and role so we'll just add this workflow will search weather based on city name and then based on temperature and humidity suggests weather it's suitable to travel or not okay so i'll just click on generate any spelling mistake it will take and it will correct it okay so now uh, we have this uh, weather travel advisor agentic workflow okay now we need to add the ai agents to this uh, in the ai agent we added the tools now in the agentic workflow we need to add the ai agents okay so i'll just search for weather info ai agent uh, that is the first AI agent and then we have travel suitability AI agent we have two AI agents so we are just adding that both the AI agents here okay now we'll just click on save and continue again we don't have any trigger if there are any triggers based on uh, the record created record updated or uh, the schedule job type daily weekly then we can add that but we don't have anything like that so we'll just save and test okay now uh, so here agentic workflow is selected now this is there so again i'll just simply ask whether whether in hyderabad okay so i'll just start testing okay now uh, it decides which ai agent to be triggered so that is the orchestrator okay so weather info ai agent is triggered okay now it provided the uh, weather conditions for hyderabad okay yeah now this is checking travel suitability uh, based on the weather conditions now it says weather conditions are unsuitable for travel today so let's check so the temperature is 23 that is greater than 18 that is suitable actually but humidity we can see that is 94 what we said uh, in this condition temperature is less than 18 and greater than humidity is greater than 60 that is unsuitable so that's why we are getting uh, the message here that weather conditions are unsuitable for travel today to hyderabad okay now we can just go to now assist panel so let me just check if i marked availability or not 
I'll just open weather travel advisor in the display yeah in the display I need to select no assist panel that we did not select so I'll just select and save it okay okay now I can go to no assist panel and here I can just ask what's weather in Kolkata today and is it suitable to travel okay I have just asked this question now based on the question it will show us the response uh, and it will select the agentic workflow okay it just started the uh, travel weather travel advisor agentic workflow there are many agentic workflows present but it just picked up this based on uh, the description name that we added okay now this is showing the data for Kolkata and we and this is now executing the second uh, AI agent that is suitability AI agent now this is saying whether conditions are unsuitable for travel because either uh, the temperature that is 30 it is greater than 18 that is fine but humidity that is 74 that is greater than 60 that's why it's showing that is unsuitable for travel now uh, for this weather info ai agent we, are, we were able to see the json right that is because of display output so while adding the tool so let's go to the tool okay we added the search weather tool and while adding that we mark display output as yes that's why it is showing the json there so we'll just say it as no and here uh, just we'll test the supervised as well so we, we, we said autonomous so now this time we'll say supervised so let's see uh, how the flow will wait for human intervention okay so i'll just save this okay now let's go to the now assist and we'll ask weather in indoor now they should wait uh, for triggering the first ai agent okay now uh, it has triggered the agentic workflow uh, it is asking us to proceed to trigger the ai agent now if we say yes then only it will proceed otherwise not so it is waiting for human intervention Okay. earlier when it was autonomous it was getting that automatically and here uh, we are not able to see uh, the json now that is the output okay now uh, the llm has shown that in uh, in this way okay where we can see humidity humidity is 88 percent and this is temperature is 24 percent 24 degree celsius okay that's why this is unsuitable so this is how we can configure AI agents and agentic workflows in ServiceNow. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please hit the thumb icon, share the video with your friends and subscribe the channel for more videos like this. Thank you.